I'm someone that over the years has gained the belief that things happen for a reason, that there's energies all around us and opportunities around every corner. Another thing I've realized is you need to be willing to accept these opportunities and let them guide you on a journey. So I'm Mike, and I'm a filmmaker. I also work in the world of sports TV broadcast as a video editor, and that job luckily has sent me traveling all over the world. Ten years ago, after one of these jobs, I met up with some family and friends in Italy, and one of our stops was to Sicily, where my great-grandfather is from. I was only there a couple of days, but Sicily made a great impact on me, and I wanted to see more. I wanted to see where my family was from and get to know the island better. So the following year, I went back and ventured out to other parts of the island. And then every summer after that, I continued to come back to Sicily. In 2018, I traveled there with my good friend Matt, who also has family in Sicily, and we were actually inspired to start working on a screenplay based on the experiences we had in the small towns searching for his relatives. In 2019, we came back to Sicily, put together a production, shot the film, and over the course of the next year, edited it and finished it. 2020, of course, came along, and our plans to bring the film to Sicily, have our premiere, screen it around the island, sadly all came to a screeching halt. I've always been a fan of travel shows, but I haven't always been a fan of the way they treat Sicily. Everyone from Rick Steves to Anthony Bourdain to more recently Stanley Tucci address the same old cliches when they talk about Sicily and never spend much time on it. People love to talk about the Godfather, the Mafia, cannoli, and listen, I get it. These are things I'm interested in too, but I know for a fact that this island deserves a much deeper dive. So even though the world and our film were on an indefinite pause, I still wanted to keep making things in Sicily. So I came up with a plan to make a travel show about Sicily in my own way and simultaneously promote our film via visiting the cast and crew who worked on it in the different parts of Sicily where they're from. The first one on the list was actor Francesco Torre, who in our movie played the sidekick Paolo and was an obvious choice as my co-host. He quickly grew his role into producer and brought the project to the Sicilian Film Commission, who agreed to collaborate with us. And just like that, suddenly we were producing my dream project, a full-fledged travel show all about Sicily. So that takes us up to the summer of 2021, where I made my first stop to meet up with Francesco and begin our adventure in his hometown on the west coast of Sicily, in Marsala. Me too, look at you. Oh my God. Look at your body. My Let's body. see me in see your face. face. Let me see your face. Okay, I have the mustache too. I love the mustache. <laughs> you wanna eat? I, I think, yes. Yeah. We need to get some breakfast, some yeah, coffee. Yeah, we have to, no. Okay. It's a surprise for you. Okay. Okay? We'll get some food. Yeah, exactly. Okay.